Okay, in this tutorial, we're going to discuss how to burn pictures onto a CD. So we're going to go down to our Start menu. We're going to go to Pictures, and I'm left-clicking every time, so we're going to left-click on Pictures. Now, we've got all these pictures, but we don't want to burn them one folder at a time, right? So what we're going to do is there is a little button on your keyboard called Control. It's abbreviated CTRL. What we're going to do is we're going to hold that button down, and then what we're going to do is we're going to click we're going to click on the different folders that we want to put into our particular pictures disk. So while I've got the control uh, button held down, I'm going to left click on all the different folders I want to burn onto this particular CD. And as you see, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six folders highlighted. Now that I've got all the folders I want highlighted, and you can scroll up and down and pick more if you'd like, we're going to continue to hold down the control button. And now, just before we go up to this top menu to click Burn, we let go of the control button, and then we're going to left-click on Burn, and it's going to say, OK, enter a blank disk into the drive, and my professional assistant here is going to pull that disk out. All right, so we've got our blank CD. We're going to drop it in the drive down here. We're going to push it in. Now, we're going to go back to the computer, and we're going to give the computer just a chance to read that disk it'll read that disk and then it'll give us the next prompt which is should be to name the particular okay so it's saying hey want to name this uh, name this disk and here's one more important part we want to click on this little down arrow and we want to click on mastered so we don't want this to be a live file system we want this to be a mastered disk and up here we can name it and we can say reunion picks and I probably spelled that wrong, but that's okay. And then we're going to click on Next. And then it is going to copy all that to a temporary folder. And we're going to click on Burn to Disk. And then we're going to click on Next. And then it is currently burning that data to the disk. When it's done, it will pop the drive out. And uh, you'll be ready to go. If it does not pop the drive out, you can simply go down there, press the button to get it to come out manually. So that's all there is to it, to burning uh, pictures onto a, a disk.